Assalamu alaikum students I am Shahnaz Ansari Today I am going to explain you the second chapter of English Who is the greatest Children this is the story about the Akbar and Birbal We all heard about Akbar and Birbal We heard many stories too who was akbar akbar was the greatest ruler and birbal was his minister and advisor so here is the lesson about akbar and birbal pay attention while i'll reading and explaining emperor akbar or akbar the great is known as one of the greatest rulers in the world not just because he had a vast empire a very strong army untold wealth but because he was a good human being children here the meaning of vast is very big now he cared for his subject what is the meaning of subject the meaning of subject is the people who lived under his kingdom he had great respect for scholars writers poets and artists belonging to different religions he was a patron of art and culture the nine gems or navratnas in his court were famous many people believe that of these nine gems birbal was the closest to the emperor's heart akbar loved to pose interesting questions or problems in his court and birbal never failed to come up with an equally interesting answer as you know children that birbal always used to give art questions in his court who is the one who always give the answer and solve his problem yes he is birbal now next paragraph we don't know whether all the akbar and birbal stories that we heard today have any basis in history they have been handed down over generations mainly by word of mouth there are two of them we all have heard many stories about akbar and birbal children but we are not sure that that is true or just it's a story here in this chapter there are two stories about akbar and birbal so one story is here one day the emperor entered the court with a very serious expression on his face as soon as he was seated he said i have a question for all of you what should be the punishment for someone who pulls my mustache children what is the meaning of mustache mustache see here this is called mustache the hair below the nose mustache the court was stunned all were in shock what pull the emperor's mustache it was unheard of it's very strange who have a guts who pulls the emperor's mustache so king ask you tell me what should be the punishment if somebody do that flog him give him 50 lashes of the whip exclaimed one noble man that's not enough put him in jail without food and water said another all the men in the court present were giving 
the solutions or punishment so what should be the person should give if he pull the mustache some are telling give him lashes or whip some are telling that put him in a jail without food and water